Hey guys, I'm Sierplin here, and welcome to another Minecraft video. And in today's video, I'll be showing you guys on the new update um, in beta. So this is only in Android devices. This is 0 0.16.0 beta for Minecraft Pocket Edition. And this is a super duper great update. I want to show it to you guys because... Um, they added commands. Now, this is a big step for MCPE. Great step. I believe... I, I, I like commands, and I want to do commands, and there are commands in this update. So, um, it's great. Completely new GUI. Well, not on the home screen, but, you know. Um, you'll see what I'm talking about later. But for now, um, I'm going to show you guys that, um, in the, um, changelog... So, um, you see in the changelog, they added Ocean Monuments, Guardians, Elder Guardians, Prismarine, and all these Prismarine blocks go with the, um, Ocean Monument, Sea Lantern, um, you can now use, um, slash commands. So, that's what I was talking about. Um, even if you're in survival, so that means, but you need to have, like, enable cheats and disable, disenable cheats and things like that, but, um, good news, um, left-handed players, you can now do custom and key binding for your keyboard, yay, so, like, you know, like, 1.9 came out, and they had that, like, left-handed option, same thing for here, it's back, and you can now use search and creative inventory, oh, there you go, but that is only for Windows 10 edition, okay, so no, like, freaking out now and go, like, ah, Okay, um, only for Windows 10 Edition. I hope it comes to MCPE, okay? But, um, added UI like this, and the, um, this is, um, only for Windows 10, the bottom two. But wet and dry sponges is for, um, MCPE, the actual MCPE, <laughs> for mobile devices also. So, um, there's a bunch of tweaks, lots of cool new G UI changes, like I said. Um... There's a bunch of things, um, some bug fixes, um, but there's going to be a lot more bug fixes than before, because, oh wow, there's a lot of bug fixes, there's a, um, temple, um, because, um, it's always beta, and right now it's only beta 1, but, um, yeah, it's all good. So, um, let's go back to MCPE, and, um, you'll see what I'm talking about by the new UI changes, um, you see, um, this is all regular, but when you do create new world, look at this. So you have regular game, multiplayer, and you'll see it's all good. Um, survival, creative. They got rid of, like, that small world. It's either... But they also added hardcore, so... Um, no, 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 that's difficulty, so... Hard, normal, easy, right. That's difficulty. And world type, you see, they don't have that small world anymore. So, yeah... It's bad, but anyway, hope they add in like 0 dot, um, 17 dot oh, like adventure mode and um, hardcore mode. That would be good. And maybe they add it in the next um, alpha build, but who knows? Um, it's not good. I created a world here. Um, so, yeah. So now when we go here, um, you can see the old commands in game. So, uh, load, there you go. Here it is. A little bit laggy because it's after build, but it's all good. So, um, you'll see that, um, I can do a bunch of things, like, um, slash, slash, um, spawn point. So now, um, I enter that, and now that's my spawn point. So, when I go over here, let's say... Where this cactus is. And then I'm going to go into survival mode. This is also a good example. Because I can do from here in the game. Slash game mode. Survival. And then there we go. Now you see I'm dying from the cactus. You'll see that my spawn point will be over there, the one I set. And there you go. Now I can respawn, and exactly where I was. Now, um, I was 
um, right there, and that was my spawn point, so, um, yeah, so now, without, I don't need to go out and in-game, but, um, I can just change my game mode from in here, so, um, I think that's really useful, and, um, cre creative, and this could be some annoying sometimes, because you still have the, like, the autocorrect there, so sometimes it can, like, we have in-game words, which don't make sense in real life, <laughs> but, um, um, it's, I think it's okay, you can, like, disable autocorrect in settings, I think, but it's all good, there's also been a slight update, um, I think this is an update, I'm not sure, but, um, like, in phones and stuff, oh, wow, new GUI change, that is all good. You can export world, right? Always day, always night. You can do this from in the settings inside the game. So I can even do my game mode in the settings right here. So it'll be faster than in commands. Wow. Did not know that. Wow. So settings got like a billion times better. Okay. And difficulty in game. Multiplayer now. Key and keyboard, like, like, I don't have it, but that's for, like, Windows 10. Controller, you have all this good stuff. You have, you can destroy, destroy block, vibrate, okay, for phones and stuff like that. That's what I thought is new, but I, I'm pretty sure it was there before for, like, phones and stuff. But, um, that's set for on, on the default, but I like it off, because, um, when it vibrates, like... When I destroy, when I destroy lots of blocks, like, it takes a bunch of battery life out of your phone. And, yeah. And, um, have that off. They make it, like, you need to have all this stuff on. And, yeah, so, um, you see you have the lefty on and off. And, yeah. So, um, not a lot of new things here. They said that there was, like, the, um... Guardians, like the Sea Temple, but they don't have the Guardian Spawn Egg in yet. But um, they have it in game, so they'll probably add that in like Alpha Build 2. But, um, you know, as they say, always follow the river to a uh, ocean. So we'll, we'll look for really quick for an ocean monument. And if we can't, um, I'll be right back. So be right back, guys. Okay, guys, I'm back, and what I also found while trying to look for the ocean temple is a village. Now, in this update, the wood goes with the biome. So, we're in this acacia biome, right? Whatever it is. Now, if you've seen this, look. We have acacia wood for, like, the village. Now, this looks really odd, but I think I like it because, like, they're orangish, reddish, you know? And it looks cool. Um, looks kind of neon to me, but... <laughs> So you see the village door, doors all acacia, and like all the inside acacia and that, and I think it's cool because they should go with the biome. So um, I think it's cool and yeah, let's see if we can trade with villagers. Can we? Like there's a little but bottom button. No, can't trade. Okay, <laughs> we can't trade. But um, I don't think I'm gonna find a um, a um village yet. But, um, anyway, um, yeah, maybe there is a monument in here now. I think this is, like, a big lake, because it's all surrounded by land, but it's got to be pretty deep in here. Yeah, so, anyway, um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Sorry if I couldn't show the ocean monument to you guys. Maybe in a... Maybe in another alpha build, I'll show you guys, like, a seed with one. But anyway, guys, um, I thank all of you guys for watching, and I'll see all of you. And where's my third-person view thing? <laughs> but anyway, guys, anyway, guys um, see you guys in my next video. Remember to leave a like and subscribe to my channel, and bye! Hell yeah!